everybody. Mr. Morbid here. As you can see, we got the Xbox 360 up. Thought I would uh, bring back good old gameplay of Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 on the 360. I don't, I'm sure there's a bunch of you that knows that this existed on the 360, but it was an early arcade game for the 360. It's since been delisted. As a bunch of good games have, as you see, here's the two Ninja Turtles arcade games. Well, Turtles in Time has been, it's actually remastered. Very good remaster of that, but we're going to give UMK3 a run here today. Uh, spoiler, spoiler, I actually do not enjoy UMK3. A lot of people seem to... Uh, label it as one of their favorites uh not me um i think it's a really good two-player game you know if you've got some buddies to sit around and play with yeah it's great that way but for somebody that just wants to sit down and play some mortal Kombat single player wise no this game is the cheapest most irritating game that you will play the uh the cpu the way they read your inputs is insanely cheap but uh you'll see a bunch of that let's let's uh go through here we uh of course there, there was achievements for this game which you can see win a total of 100 live matches do a friendship online win 10 complete a fatality online almost everything was online Beat Noob Cybot. I think you do that after you beat the game. You can choose one of the little rewards and you can uh, fight Noob. I think it's how you get that one. Uh, do a Babality. Right there is beating the game. Um, yeah, so... A lot of people may not know that this thing was, a, was available on the Xbox 360. Here's some settings. As you can see, there's two settings why would you turn these off and you're playing mortal kombat I, uh, don't ask me i've said that before in other videos where you have the option to turn blood and violence on and off i don't i don't know why you would even have purchased mortal kombat if you're that sensitive to those things but i digress let's uh let's jump into it here so this is basically the arcade game there's i don't think there's any difference and if anything, it's a little more, a little more hectic, uh, the way the AI is. Um, like I said, it's so cheap, and you can, you can, you can cheat it a little bit. I'll pick smoke. I, I'm, I'll show you how to cheat. I'm not gonna do any long ladders here. I want this thing over with. <laughs> I don't want to be here all day because the first two fights are usually your easiest. It's almost like they just want you to feel like you're winning. And then by the third fight, uh, it's going to start taking your money, which is what it was intended to do. Not a secret, you know. Uh, Smoke wins. But yeah, the this game was never... It's just never one of my favorites. I, I do... There's things I like about it. You know, it's, it's, it's uh, hard to... You know, say that I love vanilla MK3 and then I hate this one, but I just hate how cheap this game is. At least vanilla MK3, you know, you can you can you can plow through the ladder of that game, and it you know the difficulty almost stays the same. It doesn't it doesn't cheat you out of feeling like you're accomplishing anything. This game, on the other hand, this, this game's pretty rough. We'll try to get through it. The the endurance matches are the uh, that's where you you'll have the most issues, especially if they give you jade on the endurance. He is. I can't remember Smoke's fatality. I'd, I'd rather just plow through this ladder anyway. Fight. But as you can tell, the game the game is it's literally the arcade. 
And I think you can adjust your screen. Let's see. Yeah, you, you can adjust your screen here. You can, uh, I think it looks, I think it looks silly. Like that. may have made it smaller there. Let's see. Go back. There. We'll, we'll, we'll keep it there. But let's see. Um there, that's how you that's how you cheap cheap this game out. You jump back with smoke. Of course she beats me when I'm trying to do something, but you, you you jump back and kick. She'll throw a projectile. He or she works on almost everybody. Just do this, and then you do your teleport, and that's how you cheat the game. Works on. I'm sucking right now, but she's, she's kind of got me. They're probably gonna beat me here. Okay. Yeah, that's how you cheat the game. It's... Fucks that you have to do that, but... You know, it is what it is. I do know in UMK3, Kyle Khan is a... He is... He is seriously rough news. It's almost like he, he reads your inputs worse than the regular fighters do. I hate having to play like this. I really do. Because it's, it's literally the same. You do the same thing every match. You know, you don't... Well, yeah, you don't have to do this, but if you don't, you're, you guys are going to sit here and watch me get my hell handed to me 30 minutes and I don't want that nobody wants to sit here and do that but UMK3 I, I was never you know even on the it came out on Super Nintendo and Genesis and Saturn I just I have all of them just because I'm a collector, but man, it is, it is definitely, he's not, he's not giving in. There we go. Wins. Round two, fight. I honestly think that UMK3 was it was a uh, it was a placeholder. They kind of needed something. They needed to put something out to keep people reminded that Mortal Kombat, you know, was still driving and kicking. And I want to say during that time is when most most companies were transitioning to. Um, 3D era, so you know they had Mortal Kombat 4 on deck, and um, this was basically DLC. Look at that! Did you see that? His harpoon went right through her. She ran. <laughs> wow. I'm, this is where I'll take my first loss, probably. Gave me one there. There we go. Let's just hope they comply on this round too. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, 
tried to grab her with the air throw like that. Sorry I'm not doing any fatalities or anything. I sh probably should have looked them up beforehand, but... Uh, like I said, I, I love Mortal Kombat. I just don't love this one. And I find it wild when people are like, Oh, that's the greatest one of all. And, you know, I mean, you know, it's, it's awesome that you think that. And like I said, I do, I do think this is a great, um, you know, wins. couch co-op buddy. Fight. Let's have some Mortal Kombat rounds. I, I do think that. I just don't, I just don't find it pleasing to play by yourself. And that's mainly how I like to play Mortal Kombat. I've had my fair share of sitting on the couch having a few beers and playing against my buddies kind of thing, but you know, mainly I'm playing these games on my own, just like I was as a kid. Well, Taro, he can be a little bit of a butthole sometimes, too. There we go. Motaro's well, really easy in vanilla MK3, but he and Shao Kahn, they ramped up for this one. Oh, missed my... Yeah, keep doing that. I'll take that. Here he comes. He's gonna... Let me have it. Yeah, he's got me. Hmm. I can't believe it. Every time I feel like they've got me pinned or oh, he's gonna come at me hard this this time. I should really throw the, uh, the harpoon after he or the trident, whatever the smokes is. I'm I'm failing here bad. Walk back far enough. Uh, I'm giving another another go. Mm. Yeah, he's going to pin me. Watch him. Look at look at all the hits he gets before you're you're you're. Look at that. Yeah, I'm beat. He's not stopping. Look at that. Yeah. Cheap. Cheap ass, man. So cheap. Put you in a corner and all his moves come out at once. Like he, There's no pause. There's no pause in between of them. I've literally had him hit, hit me like three times before you could even... Before your character's even... You're able to even pull a move off. Harpoon come out. Oh, and I was ducking there. May it not it may not look like it on screen, but I was literally holding down before he even landed his little rising knee thing. Come on, jump at me. Hopefully we get him here. I don't want to be here all day. Uh, it doesn't look like it. He's not giving in. Here we go. Yeah, he's not. He's not. Oh my god, man. This sucks. I hate this. I really hate this game. And what's sad is... is I don't know about Khan, but I do know during the ladder fights, um, when they start treating you like this, see it? do you see how his punches come out? He had two come out at once. But I know in the ladder portion of the game, 
um, after you lose about three times, they'll basically stand there and let you win. I'm sure he's going to do that crap too. It's just so cheap. It's so cheap. It's, it's literally made to take your money. It's like, oh, well, they've, they've paid their dues, so let's let them have it. I'm getting frustrated now, so... Concentrate a little bit. I didn't even think... I wonder if that works on Khan, jumping back and kicking. I didn't even think about that. I think it's fast as his crap comes out. I don't know if it I don't know if it'll connect. Look at that, I'm holding down, man. Jeez. Alright, this is gonna be it. I'm I'll literally quit. This is not worth it. It's not worth the frustration. Fight. And there's no on this version there's no difficulty adjustment. Not that it matters anyway. Mortal Kombat difficulty never matters. Keep doing that. Oh, he's just taunting me now. Now he's gonna come on full force. Yeah, see it? Come on, keep doing that. Here we go, it's over now. He's got me in the corner. Ow. I'm sorry that was sloppy, but. Like I said, going into this, I, I warned you. I don't, I don't like this game. Never have. Um, I, I can see why people do. I just, I don't know, man. If it wasn't so cheap, it, you know, there's, there's, what is there? Five ladder choices, and here we are. We picked the the shortest, supposedly the easiest one, and. You don't know how to cheat the AI. You, you're not. You're not going to make it past the third fight without, you know, without some frustration at least. Ah, uh, yeah. But this is this is for the the Xbox 360. I I remembered I had it on my on my console downloaded, and I'm like, hey, I, I should make a video of that since I've been making videos of you know other obscure MK releases that came to the home and. Figured why not, but I won't I won't lie to you, I was dreading it. <laughs> I was dreading it and just like you heard on this last round with Shao Kahn, I was I would have quit. I would have ended the video. I would have still put it out too. Uh, I think being realistic is is I don't know, I think it's more entertaining to watch. You know, I think that's why streamers um, you know, streamers get a lot of a lot of uh, viewers because it's, it's realistic what happens happens you can't edit that you know and uh, I strive to be that I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sit here and play a game for four hours just to get two good clips so I can throw it on YouTube the way I, I get frustrated too easily and I think you could tell that <laughs> during this gameplay I get frustrated pretty easily um, I don't, it's not worth it to me I would rather, you know, like I've played these games since I was a kid, so it's not like I don't know what I'm doing, but I also know that this particular game, it's just, it's full of BS. And so, even though I wanted to put this video out, I dreaded it. But hey, I did it anyway. Here it is. I appreciate you watching. Here's where you, here, oh, sorry. Here's where you can uh, unlock the three character Sub Zero. Who is it? Sub Zero. Armac and Molina, I think. But that's it. That's going to be it for this one. I am going to sign out of here. Thanks for watching. Check out my other videos if you want to see other MK games that you probably didn't know were out there. Check you later.